Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Um, the Minister has spoken well, and I thank the Minister for her comments. I'm heartened that we will continue to meet obligations. However, can I stress the fact that literally our projects due in December were sustained by thousands of pounds of support who have lost it all as people stop all outgoing non-essential direct debit. One project that I support is Swaziland, uh, whose children were booked to be here right now, singing in concerts throughout my constituency of Frankfurt and Northern Ireland, raising monies to support the orphanage for the year that they have literally nothing for. What help can we deliver for projects not supported by government thus far, but in real dire need? State. Thank you, Mr. Speaker, and um, uh, I thank the Honourable Gentleman for his question. I think uh, the challenge of fundraising and uh, charities and organisations that have uh, really great objectives uh, and reach out to the most vulnerable uh, is indeed a challenge, but I would uh, reference anyone to uh, Captain Moore's efforts. It's possible to raise money in different and novel ways, and I encourage everyone out there to come up with brilliant new ideas uh, to do things to support the charities and the causes that they most believe in.